Hello, I'm back and the last time you saw me I was at Starved Rock State Park and in case you were concerned that I got lost there, I did. But I've also been lost in something else other than that and the pond and that is the paperwork for getting my pilot's license. And when I say pilot's license I mean to fly an unmanned aircraft. A drone. I got my drone pilot's license. And that's quite a spooky coincidence because I also got a drone. In the six years that I've been running this channel, one of the chief aims, other than telling terrible jokes, is to always improve the quality of my output, except the jokes. And I've had a little help along the way. Without my patrons, all of my videos would still look like this. Trenton. New Mexico. And that's why I always give a shout out to my patrons at the end of my video, because without them, this wouldn't have happened. Right? I mean, it would still have been made, but without them, I wouldn't have been able to afford it. So this week, we took the drone to Lincoln Park right here in Chicago. Lincoln Park has a lot of sort of open spaces. It just allows you to do it in a manner that's safe. And safety is very important to me when it comes to this. And I'm going to hand over to YouTube sensation Lawrence Brown to explain why. Sorry, I'm British to my core, worrying about health and safety. But uh, when you've got an expensive camera in your hands, there really is no choice. But all of the safety precautions in the world aligned with the fact that this, the DJI Mini 2, is an unfathomably great piece of equipment. Doesn't fully prepare you for the fact that you're sending an object into the air where it will hover. And I have to admit, the first few times that I had it take off, I was terrified that it was just going to come crashing down to earth and hit a person or a child. But once I was okay with that idea, the idea of it floating, not hitting civilians. I started to relax, I got my bearings, and I turned the drone toward the city and took my first photograph, which, cheap plug, was well received on my Instagram, lawrence.m.brown. And that was great, I would have been happy with just that, taking splendid photography from the air. But of course, the real reason that I have this thing is because it records video. And given my excitement for making travel videos, I've always enjoyed that process and I've always enjoyed the final outcome. But I needed something that was going to take it literally to the next level. It occurred to me while I was on the road on Route 66, but also in Pennsylvania, that, you know, all of this footage is great and I can tell a nice story with it. But wouldn't it be even great if you could see the landscape that I was detailing? So after taking that photograph, you'd be proud of me, I summoned up the courage to hit the video settings. And, you know, I could talk about what that was like, or I could just show you. So consider that flight a kind of dry run, even though dangerously all the way through I needed the toilet. I feel that that was just me getting started and over the coming weeks and months I want to delve deep into some of its finer settings to fine tune things like the white balance and all of the different modes that will capture America in its fine glory. Because when all is said and done, I mean, I want to fly this thing all across America. Not in one go, I mean, that would kill the battery and about five cows. But there's so much more of the United States that I will be seeing. And I think the, the great thing about this is this will allow me to see the things that I physically can't. You know, so Redwoods or the Grand Canyon or Area 51. That's out of bounds, right. So I hope you're as enthusiastic about this as I am, although that is impossible. I've literally been training it to bring me grapes. And so what I lose there in exercise, I make up for in healthy food. That's it for this episode. Let me know in the comments below if you had a favourite shot from that previous montage. I'm Lawrence Brown. You can follow me on Twitter at Lost in the Pond US. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that my videos don't get lost in the pond. And of course, a Lincoln Park size shout out to my patrons who, of course, made this possible. If you would like to become a patron of Lost in the Pond, you can do so today at patreon.com slash lost in the pond. Until the next video, goodbye.